Hi, how's it going everyone? Welcome back. I'm Don and you're watching VR Gamer Dude and Happy New Year. It is 2024 and to start the new year, we have a new set of XR glasses. But are they really new? I don't know. Let's find out. Okay, so for those of you who have been watching my channel, or at least this year, you're going to know I should probably be called XR Gamer Dude at this point because I review a lot of XR tech these days. And over this year, out of all of the glasses that I've reviewed, one definitely stood out, and that was the Vitcher One and the Vitcher One neckband. And you know, this has been the best XR system, in my opinion, that you could get. But after I did my review, there were some questions from some of my audience members as to, well, first of all, the higher price. These are definitely one of the highest price XR glasses out there. And the proprietary magnet connector. A lot of people were kind of leery about that because everybody else is using the USB-C. It's a little more of a universal connector. So I'm happy to say that as of this morning, January 1st, 2024, you can now pick up a new product from Vitcher, and that is the Vitcher One Lite. And what's the difference? Well, the big difference between the Vitcher One and the Vitcher One Lite is going to be the fact that they changed it to a standard USB-C connection. So no more proprietary magnet connector on the glasses themselves. And they also removed the electrochromatic film darkening as a cost saving measure. So that means they can pass those savings on to you guys and you can now pick up a pair of Vitcher One lights for $349. Now, since they removed that magnetic connector, that does bring up one question though. Did they change the neck band? And they didn't. They, they actually still have the magnet connector on the neck band. So how are you going to be able to connect your new Vitra One lights if you grab a neck band? Well, I'm happy to say they also brought out a magnetic connector to USB-C adapter. And man, one cool thing about this, and I've been getting that question a lot this year as well, is will this allow other manufacturers glasses to work with the neckband computer? And I am happy to say it absolutely does. So if you have Xreal Air 2, Xreal Air 2 Pro, Xreal Air, Rokid Max, Dream Glass, I believe, any of those should now be able to connect to the neck band, which in my opinion is the premier computer interface that you can use with your XR glasses at this point. So I am super happy about that. All of the testing that I've done with my other one has worked great. So I cannot recommend this enough. So if you wanna grab a set, and I highly recommend that you do, I'm going to have links for everything that you need in the description. Go grab these. If you want to see the full review, I do have a full review on everything that Vitcher offers on my channel. There will be links for all of this in the description. And as always, no secret, I am a affiliate of Vitcher. I love their product, so I did accept an affiliate code from them. If you use code VRGAMERDUDE or the link in my description, you can get an extra 10% off of your order. You can't go wrong with that. It's a wonderful price for a great set of glasses. But for me, that is going to do it. Thank you so much for watching to the end of the video, and I will see you in the next one. This is Don, signing off.